Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, hi, my name is Chris Smith, uh, Shambles Guru on the interweb, and I live in Chiang Mai, North Thailand, where I'm making this screencast. And the screencast is about how to connect to the Aussie Live online conference, which uh, is going to happen in a couple of days' time, as I record this anyway. And uh, this is to show you how you can log on. I'm using a Windows machine at the moment and uh, I'm using Google Chrome browser but any Windows and any browser should uh, should be okay for this I have to say now and I mentioned it at the end that my preferred way of actually attending these conferences is using my iPad because of the iPad it's a real doddle you can look that up on Google if you don't know what a doddle is and uh, anyway let's, let's jump into this all this down here is a bit of mm, PR for my websites have a look at my YouTube channel Shambles Guru, youtube.com Shambles Guru. So let me move this splash page out of the way, which is actually just a, a Word document. And uh, we're going to go to this page, th this URL here. So this is what you need to remember AussieLive.com. Uh, move the splash page out of the way. And uh, I already put it into here. And what it does is it redirects you to AustralianEducators.ning.com. Um, as you imagine, this is a uh, an initiative, a conference that comes out of Australia, and everything's at Australian friendly times. So if you live in Australia, you don't have to get up in the middle of the night <laughs> to attend the sessions, uh, like you do when they're coming out of the states or they're on states or even European time. Um, so this is a social network, um, which serves also as a, a gateway to the conference. You can sign up, but you don't have to sign up. Um, for the purposes of this, I'm not going to sign up. I'm just going to uh, leave it as uh, open, uh, uh, as the public would see it. Um, but I would advise you signed up and signed in, because then when you do that, you get access to lots of other discussion areas where you can talk with other educators and you can have discussions about the conference sessions. But also, this is a year-long initiative. It's not just the conference. So if you're, if I was an Australian teacher... Uh, without a shadow of a doubt, I'd, I'd join here and I'd sign in now, but I'm not going to sign in. But if you did scroll down this front page, you'd see several. Th you'd see a series of postings, their, their blog postings about the about the conference. Um, here's the main flyer, Aussie Live 2015. It's the second time the conference has been run, and I've been really privileged to be part of uh, the organisers group. Um, I'm certainly not the, the the hardest worker. There's some of them that are really working their socks off on this. And uh, look down here and you can find uh, more information about the conference and about the network as well. There's also a Twitter feed. And this is a Twitter feed here. You see there's some tweets here from me. And they're being, uh, in this live Twitter feed, they're being displayed because all the Twitter uh, postings have the hashtag Aussie live there so if you post about if you're a Twitter user and if you're an educator and not a Twitter user please put it on your to-do list to learn uh, Twitter is an amazing tool for educators for finding information and keeping up to date uh, and asking for help uh, which is amazing so so there's a lot there regardless of the conference but let's go and look at the conference um, which happens in the last two days of February 2015 and the first day of March. Schedule, let's look at the schedule, click on here. So there's lots of information here about the conference, how to attend, mobile users, um, links to download the mobile app is here. Oh, that's useful, I hadn't noticed that before. Um, the schedule now, I think at the moment this is actually Australian time. Um, so is, does that make it th three in them? I'm not sure. I've always meant to know, to look up what UTC is. Um, universal time something, I'm sure. But anyway, the, the clever thing here is that for you to see the conference and the times the conference are in your time zone, you need to look at this list. And let me find me. I'm in, Bang I'm in Thailand, which is Bangkok, which is GMT. Uh, plus seven hours. So let me click on that. 
So that now gives the time at this very moment for me. So I'm recording this at 10, 10, 10 13 at night on Wednesday, the 25th of February, 2015. And here is the conference. <coughs> and the times of each of the sessions is the local times for me. So it starts this coming Friday for me, the 27th of February, 2015. Uh, 9 o'clock in the morning is the first session. There's a few sessions on the Friday, uh, and then there's some on the Saturday. You see, for me, it starts at 4 a.m. in the morning. I will not be getting up. Um, but these are f friendly times if they were, if it was set on uh, Australian times. Friendly times for Australia and New Zealand. And then it goes on to Sunday. So that's how you find the schedule. Very straightforward. It's actually, I think it's really clever how that's been done. Uh, now let's see how we actually attend a session. So let's say we want to attend the physics of jumping castles using apps to teach science. Well, I'm a, a, a trained science teacher from a long time ago, and I'm a mobile uh, teaching and learning guru, fanatic evangelist. So let's look at this one. Now if you want details about it, there's all the details are down, all the details are down here. Who the, who the organizer, the speaker is, um, a bit about them, the session, a bit about their bio. bio. Um, you, you can come and read this yourself. The important thing is session link. And it has, uh, it's here, HTTPS, colon, slash, 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 illuminate. The platform for this webinar conference from this series of, of presentations is called Blackboard Collaborate, but it used to be called Illuminate. Uh, and then was bought up and changed. So you, so you still see the name Illuminate around, but it's the platform is Blackboard Collaborate. So let's click on this and see what happens. So it's saying log into the session. So you can put any name in here. You can put your real name. You can put in a pseudonym if you like. Um, and what shall I put? Let me put... Actually, I'm going to put this one. Let me see this one. Shambles Guru Thailand. Actually, I put the at sign there so that people know that's my Twitter handle, my Twitter name. And I actually like to put where I am. I put Thailand. So if you're in a t you know, whatever town you're in, in Australia or New Zealand or wherever globally, it's nice to put it there and then people can see where you come from in chat. So let's log in. Now, the first time you do this, it's going to be a real headache. Trust me. Uh, so it's good to log in before you even uh, um, before you even uh, come to the conference. Don't wait to the last minute. So it wants to download this file. Let me save it. And that was it. That was quite click. And now I'm going to click on here and say open. But before I do that, I want to tell you that the first time you do this, <laughs> that bell you can hear in the background is one of our cats running around. Um, the first time you do this and you try and open this file, it'll probably say, I can't open it. In which case, go go to this area and download this thing called the Blackboard Collaborate Launcher. You only need to do that one time um, uh, um, for, it, <laughs> for it to work. Sorry, I'm laughing at the, the cats. They're not getting my attention. They're, they're moaning. Oh, sorry, meowing. Um, but I've already downloaded the Blackboard Collaborator Launcher. It takes about 20 minutes, so be patient on that. And so let's open this thing down here, and hopefully it will log me in. It will download the software, the tiny bit of software, which is the actual uh, Blackboard Collaborate. Here we go, the Blackboard Collaborate um, platform. Now I was tempted, I'm tempted to pause the recording here, but I'm not going to pause it pause it because I want you to really see how long it takes and what happens. Here we go, Blackboard Collaborate, and here we go. Oh, that's open nicely. Now, of course, th it's two days before this particular session starts, so there's not going to be much here, except there might be some advice. There isn't. Actually, while I'm here, just let me show you this. Um, so this is what you see. Now, it might not be nice and neat like this because all these things will move, can move around. You can actually undock them and move them around. This, you can see I can take this thing out the way 
all the bits you can move around. So you can move them around your screen and make them as big as you want to, depending on if you've got a big laptop screen or desktop screen. These are instructions just for the presenters and mod moderators. You should never see this. Um, but what you will see here is the PowerPoint slides or the, the graphics or the visuals from the presenter. Uh, so you'll see them here. And uh, over this side, you'll see who is signed in. I'm signed in. There's my name. Uh, but you'll see the list of people that are actually online and taking part in here. Uh, there'll be a moderator at the top. Uh, and the presenter's name at the top and then down here you can do chat but chat's not switched on at the moment but there'll be a window at the bottom left hand corner here where you can actually chat and and that's brilliant because while the presenter's going talking and showing stuff people can actually chat and contribute so if you know a website that supports something the presenter just said then you can add that website here um, and that's so valuable. In fact, you can download this chat uh, later from from one of these up here. I can't remember which one now, but one of these one of these allows you to download or oh, save. I bet it's here. Save the participants list, chat, and the whiteboard, which is this is the whiteboard. You might be given permission to write on the whiteboard by the presenter, but it depends on the presenter and how much participation and collaboration they want to have in here. Other things here, you might be asked to vote, and these things up here allowed you allow you to do voting. Um, so you might ask, be asked a question in here and asked to vote, and you'll see how everybody votes in, in here. Have I missed anything out? I think that's it. It's supposed to be short, but it's not as sh it's, this is longer than I'd hoped for, um, but it, ho hopefully it's helpful. And to to get rid of everything, you just click on file, click on exit, and when you click on exit, you actually get a a web browser page questionnaire evaluation questionnaire there's no you don't have to fill that in but it's it's nice if if you uh, you can fill it in oh here it go, here it comes now so there's a session survey here um so please do it helps it make uh, the conference uh, a better event next time it's next time it's done now i mentioned uh mobile app and and i'm going to spend another minute on that sorry about this um, I've already gone to this page and this is the iTunes Apple.com if you have an iPad if you have an iPad and there isn't really an echo but if you have an iPad then download this app because the, it's brilliant to view this on an iPad um, and uh, and the app is free and to to participate is free and if you have the app on the iPad let me go back to here. Do you remember? Do you remember this was the uh, part, the uh, list of all of the uh, sessions. Let me just close this. This is the list and timing of all the sessions. Well, you still go to this web page on your iPad, and when you click on this link, it will open up the app and appear in the app without any of that hassle about downloading uh, any particular uh, software. Windows and some t for the first time on Windows it'll be a real headache, but please stick with it. It's worth it. But you, you, yeah, maybe have a nice rum and coke or a beer next to you while you're doing it. Nice thing with online sessions. That's it, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. I hope that's interesting. And if you are at the conference, well, uh, I'll I'll be in some of the sessions myself. Not at four in the morning. Uh, maybe hope to see you there. And if you do see me there, give me a shout out in chat. Have fun.